Managers can actually learn a lot from comedian Seth Meyers. I'm a huge fan of Seth Meyers. He is a comedian, producer, writer, and of course, TV host. I love watching interviews of creative people, comedians, artists, producers, writers, because I find it so fascinating how they have to come up with an idea and then go through this whole process to make that idea happen. And so one of the things that I found particularly interesting with this interview of Seth Meyers was how he talked about his team. He loves his team. He's so supportive of his team. And he's created this really wonderful collaborative working environment so everyone feels like they can come into the office, share their ideas, and do their best work together to create this show. I also love the fact that he talks about the importance of understanding that his team, they have their own goals. They have their own passions, and he knows that. He understands that. So when they are working on other projects, maybe they're writing because they're a comedian and they're writing jokes to go on stage, or they have a screenplay that they're hoping to get made one day, he helps them get better, and he also will go so far as to introduce his team to the right people, or even go to a meeting if he thinks that will be helpful in getting that project made. Talk about someone who really cares about their people. Not only is he coaching them while they're there to get better at the work that they're doing for him, but he cares about their dreams and their passions and their goals in their own life, and he does whatever he can to make them successful. If you are a manager, if you lead a team, think about how powerful it will be if you helped your people grow. Not only, not only with their role and just their role, but also by learning their dreams and their passions and how you can play a role in helping them achieve them. Seth essentially did what Matthew Kelly talks about in his book, The Dream Manager. He learned about his people's dreams and then he helps them achieve them. Imagine coming into work every day. Imagine how different your people would show up if you cared about them that much if you helped them that much, if you coached them that much, they're gonna show up at work, they're going to be fired up to do their best work for you, for the organization, because you are helping them fulfill their own dreams and passions. Your number one role as a leader is to grow your people. And one of the best things that you can do and start doing right now is asking your people, what are your dreams? What do you wanna do? What is important to you? and then doing something, even a small thing, to help them achieve that goal. Who knew managers can learn so much from a comedian? I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, please share it with someone who you think might find it valuable as well. I'll see you next time.